In every measurement, there is always a range in the last measured digit. The hardware and software in this digital scale are rounding the last displayed digit, which occurs this time in the tens place. We state that this mass is 200.4 plus or minus 0.1 grams. When reading a digital meter, we take the range in the last measured digit to be plus or minus 1 in whichever decimal place is shown in that last digit. On this scale, the last displayed digit occurs in the thousands place, so we record the measurement as 7.368 plus or minus 0.001 grams. The measurement of this mass is m equals 7.368 grams. The experimental uncertainty is delta m equal 0.001 grams. We use the Greek letter delta to represent this experimental uncertainty. The fractional error in the measurement is the experimental uncertainty divided by the measurement equals 0.001 divided by 7.368 equals 0.0014. To measure the length of this line, we place the meter stick next to it and we see that the length lies somewhere between 6 and 7 units. The rule of thumb is to take the experimental uncertainty in the last measured digit to be plus or minus one half of that smallest unit. The edges of this paper are very distinct so we can measure the width of the paper very well. The edge of the paper can be located within the smallest division of the instrument. The smallest division of this ruler is 0.1 centimeter. Our rule of thumb is to take the experimental uncertainty in the last measured digit to be plus or minus one half of the smallest division of our instrument. So the reading is 5.52 plus or minus 0.05 centimeters. Notice that if you tilt the ruler a little, the reading changes by one millimeter or two or three or more. Estimating a reading within the smallest division of the instrument is said to be interpolation. And we take the experimental uncertainty to be plus or minus half the smallest division of the instrument. When measuring the height of this tabletop, the reading changes a lot when the meter stick is tilted just a little bit. In this case, we're not able to interpolate within the smallest division of the instrument. You get to decide the experimental uncertainty in this measurement. You might decide that you can measure accurately to 0.1 centimeter or 0.2 or 0.3, whatever you feel is best describes the situation. Parallax occurs when there is space between the ruler and the object. The meter reading changes if we look from the left side or the right side, so we are careful to avoid parallax wherever possible. When reading the height of the tabletop, parallax is not avoidable because there is a space between the ruler and the table 